This is Chef Inspire. I'm here today to talk to you about your pineal gland. And I'm gonna give you four points to actually prove my point. Point number one, what is your pineal gland? Your pineal gland is a small gland that's actually in the center of your brain. This gland is actually right behind your eyes and is activated by light. This gland is also a transmitting station. And what does it transmit? It transmits accurate information from source to you. It is the doorway to your sixth sense. And in Western societies, they actually call this the third eye. Point number two. The pineal gland is affected by fluoride. Now it's affected by fluoride. It's actually damaged by fluoride. Now our government, in, it, in its infinite wisdom, has put fluoride in our water. Fluoride in our drinking water, fluoride in our toothpaste. Now this fluoride, what it's supposed to be doing is stopping us from getting cavities. Now if they wanted to stop us from getting cavities, why shouldn't they just put the fluoride in the toothpaste? Because it's applied directly to the tooth. Why did they have to put it in our water so that when we take a shower, fluoride is being soaked into our skin? When we, anything that we drink and our animals, to anything that they drink, fluoride is in their water. Fluoride is a poison. It is actually used in, in certain countries to kill rats. And also, it was used in a concentration camp to make those people docile, to make them not fight back, to make them almost like robots, to be easily controlled. Fluoride is a killer. Point number three, the pineal gland is also damaged by this fluoride. I mean, it's damaged to the point where it doesn't operate anymore. And just imagine if you cannot get accurate information from source, from the source, from the creator. Now, have you ever heard or said to yourself, you know, something told me not to go this way. Something told me not to do this, or something told me not to listen to this person, or not, not to go around this person, because they were bad news. This is accurate information that is being given to you, and this information is coming through that pineal gland. Now just imagine if that pineal gland was operating at 100% capacity. It wasn't hindered by fluoride in any way, shape, or form. It would be stronger. You would be more accurate in what you thought about, what you, the things that you do on a regular basis. You will get accurate information that could pretty much change your life. You will be more uh, confident in everything that you do. Why? Because you're, you, are, you are being led by infinite wisdom, infinite knowledge, and infinite power. So this is why fluoride was conveniently put into your drinking water, into your toothpaste to dull you down to make you subservient, to make you almost a robot, easily to control, distracted. Because when you're distracted, you are less effective. And when you're less effective, guess what? You know, you're pretty much putty in the hands of those people who are controlling you. Point number four, these are the foods that if you eat on a regular basis, you can reverse the fluoride effects on your pineal gland. Are you ready? But first of all, first you have to get rid of those fluoride toothpastes. Get rid of them. You can use baking soda as toothpaste. Also, get rid of um, the fluoride that's in your water. You can get a fluoride filter or you can also get um, distilled water that the fluoride has been, been taken out of. When you do this, you put yourself in a position to hear accurate information from infinite wisdom, infinite knowledge, and infinite power. Our Creator has created us in such a way that He's given us a gland that we will be able to receive from Him information 
that can help us to govern our lives and to be more powerful and more effective. But because of this fluoride and because those people know, they knew that we had this gland and they know that fluoride affects it. So that's why they gave it to you. It wasn't an accident that fluoride is being put in the water, the drinking water throughout the United States and throughout the world. I mean, I'm not a conspiracy brother, but this is a conspiracy. This is a attempt to keep the masses under control. Do your research, don't take my word for it. Here's a foods that if you eat these foods on a regular basis, you will help restore your pineal gland. Number one, pineapple. Number two, coconut. Number three, watercress. Number four, avocado. Number five, bananas. If you eat these foods on a regular basis, you will actually help your pineal gland to regenerate and to become healthier again. This will also increase what you hear from infinite wisdom, infinite knowledge and infinite power. It will make you more powerful as a person. It will make you more direct as an individual and help you to accomplish so much more in your life. This is Chef Inspire. The pineal gland is one of the most important glands in our bodies. Why don't we hear more about this? Do your research. Don't take my word for it. I hope you get this. I hope you got it. And if you do, guess what? Your life will be good. God bless.